What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Dre here. And yes, we have the Samsung Galaxy S20 Plus. Today's video, we're just gonna do a quick unboxing. We're gonna set it up and just get my first impressions on the S20 Plus. But before we go on any further, if you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Dre Anthony. And on this channel, I mostly do tech reviews and unboxings like this one so if this is something that you're into please consider subscribing all right so without further ado let's get into the unboxing of the samsung galaxy s20 plus all right so from the get-go you guys can tell the samsung galaxy s20 plus i mean the box is really pretty much the same with the samsung galaxy s20 plus on the sides and on the top of the box you have that s20 just leaking almost to the edge uh, i guess that's really to show you that this phone you can expect it to be almost bezel-less all right let's open the box this is the first time i'm actually seeing this so there you have it the Samsung Galaxy S20 plus wow this is a huge screen all right so let's just take the phone out and have a look at that yeah all right and then you have the quad camera set up on the back wow the screen is huge feels pretty light feels well built yeah i like that feel anyways let's just put this to the side quickly and then um see what else comes in the box all right all right so typical samsung you usually have the this in the top of the phone i guess this is some booklets information and the sim ejection tool that you can use um open it oh lovely this is a wonderful surprise all right so i guess this is the international version because not all version comes with this but i did actually get a clear case that i can start using with the phone which is very 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 sweet very welcome save myself a couple bucks um just by using that in the meantime um you have your quick start guide Pretty much giving you all the information and the showing you all the contents of the packaging. Just put that to the side. More leaflets. Quick start guides, warranty card, all of that. So let's just put that back there. Rest that to the side. Rest that to the side. All right, so let's just look at what else we get inside the box all right so right away so we get samsung's quick charging power brick also what's this okay nothing's in that also in the box we get the usb type c the usb type c to usb type c which is lovely straight usb type c that's to attach the charging brick and uh, oh you we get some very nice akg headphones really love this this is always a welcome oh and they're braided which is really 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 quality i love that that's an added bonus love samsung's akg branded headphones they give good quality and we also get some extra tips for the earphones so that you can match to your ear size so it fits comfortably yeah 
that's pretty much it. The box is empty. All right, let's just tuck these back inside the box so that we can go ahead and have a quick look at the phone. All right, so we're just gonna leave all of that right there. All right, so as you can see, it's a really, really beautiful screen, a very beautiful phone from Samsung. This screen size is, I think it's about 6.7 inches. Um, when holding it, it's not, I'm, I don't have the biggest of hands. Um, so the phone is really, really manageable. It can be used with one hand. And yeah, it's nice. On the sides, as you can see here, we have the power button. We have the volume rocker, the up and down volume rocker. On the other side, it's clean, nothing there. At the bottom, you have one down firing speaker. You have the US, you have the USB type C port and the microphone and then on the top, you have your SIM card and your micro SD card slots. Uh, another microphone here. On the front, you can see there is a hole punch out for the camera. There doesn't look too intrusive. I don't mind it at all. And uh, there is also the speaker earpiece right at the top there. Yeah, this is really nice. On the back, it's the quad camera setup. As you guys can tell, I got the cosmic black color. There are two other colors, I believe, that come in the that comes in the S20 Plus lineup. It's um, the cosmic black, which is this one. There is the cosmic gray, and the cloud blue. I think this one is more suited, especially with that camera cutout. Thought it would have been worse, but it's not bad. One of the drawbacks already is that this tend to pick up a lot of fingerprints. So once I'm done doing this unboxing, I'm just gonna slap the case on it as quick as I can so that I can try not to get as much fingerprints on the phone. So let's just get the plastic off the back quickly. Wow, beautiful. All right, and there you have it. All right, so there's a screen protector that comes installed on the phone. I'm not gonna take that off. I'm just gonna let that stay. All right, so previously I was using my OnePlus 5T as my daily driver. I've had that phone for years. I think I have it right on the side here. Um, so this is my OnePlus 5T, and let me tell you guys, I've never, had a better experience with an android phone until i actually started using oneplus phone i might do a comparison after what three years i think this phone was out four when you look and compare both the sizes of both phone as you can see the s20 plus is just slightly bigger um i think the oneplus 5t is a six inch while as i said the s20 plus is a 6.7 inch screen so yeah both colors black and as i was saying guys i really enjoyed using the oneplus 5t for the few years i had it i was considering upgrading to another oneplus i am still considering that because of that wonderful experience that i had with this phone never felt the need to upgrade for for that while now that the oneplus 8 pro is out i might just very well get that into the studio and test it out if you guys want to see that then just leave a comment below and give this video a like but yeah this phone has been really 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 wonderful um loved it but we're gonna be testing out the s20 plus i'm gonna be using it as my daily driver for the next couple of weeks um, to see what kind of performance how do i like it and get back to you guys with a review so let's just power on the phone so that you guys can see it samsung galaxy s20 plus lovely 
gonna be testing out the camera as well guys so subscribe if you haven't subscribed so that you can see um, when that video is live on the channel yeah so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set this phone up quickly and come back and give you my final thoughts my final impressions and then wrap up the video All right guys, so I managed to partially set the phone up. It is still, you know, doing some updates in the background. Nonetheless, I figured I'd come here and show you guys what the screen actually looks like. Um, straight out the box, uh, we're using Android 10. All right, so of course the S20 comes with the ability to do 120 hertz refresh rate which makes the scrolling phone experience pretty smooth um, right now as you can see the default setting is set to 60 hertz we can go ahead and switch that to 120 hertz but bear in mind whenever we're using 120 hertz refresh rate we can only use a resolution of a full HD 2400 by 1080p um, and not 1440. I really wish that Samsung would have allowed us to use both the Quad HD screen along with 120 hertz refresh rate. Hopefully that comes in a future update, software update that we can, that they'll allow us to do that. But as it is, that's it and guys let me tell you the 120 hertz refresh rate hype is real trust me smooth experience quick it's fast yeah all right guys so we also managed to um set up the fingerprint the ultrasonic fingerprint scanner on the s20 plus uh Let's just give this a quick test to see how snappy it is. Wow, it's pretty snappy. Let's try that again. Wow, it's fast. <laughs> All right. So it is indeed pretty, pretty quick, just like that. And there's also this animation that comes up. And if you see that, oh, it's quick. This is quick. Um, and I just realized that this this wallpaper is so cool. Um, it is like a live wallpaper that you're seeing, and it changes color as as it go on. It's it's pretty nice. Um, all right, guys. So essentially, that is it for this unboxing. I'm just giving you my first impressions, um, setting it up, and. Uh, I'm going to be using this for my daily driver for the next couple of weeks. Come back to you guys with a review on it. Give you my thoughts. Test the camera out. You know, just really carrying this phone through its paces. And uh, let's see how it holds up for the couple of weeks that I'll be using it for. Let's see if I'll be satisfied um, with using this as my daily driver as i said I've, I've been using the oneplus 5t for a couple of years now so this should be a considerable you know change in um experience but yeah curious we're gonna get this phone charged and uh, start using it right away yeah so remember guys a detailed review will be coming up on this phone so ensure that you guys are subscribed so that you can see whenever i upload that video to the channel curious to test this quick charge as well to see how um, samsung's quick charge capabilities are ensure that you guys are subscribed and stay tuned to the channel um, for lots more content lots more unboxings this is just the first of many um, yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next upload.